Hi, I'm Jenna. I just got off the Burton lipstick. I'd give this board three out of five stars. Um, it's not a bad board by any means, uh, but it kind of falls into an interesting range. So it's sort of your board for your aggressive, advanced level park girl. Uh, you can still take it everywhere else on the mountain, but it's not going to hold an edge nearly as well as something like the Feel Good would. Uh, if you're more of a charger, more looking for something a little bit more responsive, um, something that you can really cruise hard on, then the Feel Good would probably be a better choice. Uh, this is going to be your board that excels a little bit more in the park. Uh, but it's not your super soft noodle board either. It's kind of a mid-flexing board um, that has Burton's v -rock, or Flying V in it, so you've got camber underneath the binding, foot rocker in the middle. Um, one thing when you get on this board the, for the first time, it might take you a little bit uh, to get used to the V-Rocker between the bindings. It might feel like your back foot's starting to kind of wash out, but once you adjust to it, um, you really can take it everywhere else on the mountain and hold it well at uh, moderate speed. So again, great board for your intermediate to advanced level park girl who still wants to be able to take it and cruise lightly around the rest of the mountain.